Hey, baby. I just wanted to send a quick hello, and I love you. Oh, good news. I'm going to be coming home soon. Yay! Oh, I cannot wait to be done with this babysitting job and come home to my loving husband. I miss you. Oh, I got to get back to work. I love you, Ethan. I miss you so much. I'm sending tons of kisses. Bye, baby. Ethan. You were right. I did lie to you. I shouldn't have... All I can say is that if you get this, stay away. Hello? Hey, it's, uh, it's Ethan. Oh, hey. You all right? You just disappeared the other night. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. It's Mia. She's not dead. She's alive. She, she's back. They found her? How? What happened? I don't know. Look, I, I don't know how, but she's back. She's back somehow. And maybe it's a prank, but she wants me to come and get her. Where is she? Dolby. Dolby, Louisiana. Dude, it's been three years. I know, I know, but what if it is her? I have to find out what happened. This is the place. Hello everybody, it's me again. And welcome to our very first full-length VR playthrough on the channel. And frankly, if we're being honest with each other here, I have been 100% absolutely dreading playing this since I played the kitchen demo a few weeks ago. Okay! <laughs> but I'm finally gonna do it. God damn it. I mean, I was... <laughs> if we're putting it into perspective here, I was scared to play Until Dawn by myself. And now I'm playing this? <laughs> like, what the, what the fuck is wrong with me? But here we are with Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. Uh, we just got into Dolby, Louisiana, I believe. If I just hit B... Um, I'm watching, my monitor's blank because of the capture hood up, hookup, so I'm looking at my capture, which is on a couple second delay. So you just see we're in this, like, swampy forest-looking area. I'm assuming it's, like, a secluded area where the bakers live. And, uh, yeah. We just had a series of cutscenes, and, I mean, I probably edited them in, in there, so yeah. You see, I got some new, uh, accessories on my VR headset. The little googly eyes I got at Michael's. <laughs> I'm just taking some time because my capture was acting funny the last time I tried to record in VR, so... I'm just keeping an eye on it since I can't when this thing's over my eyes. I have my cloth here in case my tears soak up the goggles and I need to wipe them off. <laughs> I did the tutorial already, so I know the basics of how to play. Yeah, and I turned on subtitles for you guys. And this is really weird. <laughs> I keep, I'm, I'm by default using the right stick to move. So if I were to, I can walk one way and nope, 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 it shifts me. That's weird. Okay. Well, Jesus Christ, okay. <laughs> I jumped at that. I jumped at that. <laughs> Fuck me. Okay, this is gonna be bad, I know it. That's the house. Fuck my life. Let me just check real quick. Yep, still going. Okay. Beautiful. I don't know how long this session's gonna be, guys. It depends on how long I can handle. What button is that? What button is that? That's not a button that's on my controller. So triangle, find Mia. 
email from Mia. A printout of the email from your wife, Mia, who has been missing for... Oh, wow, she's been missing a long time. If you took the baby... If you took a babysitting gig from these guys, you're stupid. But yeah, I, I recognized her almost immediately from the kitchen demo. Because I remember... I forget who, I'm sorry. It was one of you lovelies who posts on almost all of my videos. Um, you posted a comment that said, yeah, that's not the mother. Um... And I, oh, can I not go over this? Oh my god, this is disorienting. Like, seriously? When I'm trying to, like, ugh, my legs tingle because, like, is this what amputees feel like? <laughs> Honestly? Because, like, I feel like my legs should be doing something to walk over here, but they're not. So my legs are kind of freaking out right now, as is my heart and my brain and the rest of my body. So, you know, actually, all's well. Oh, it's locked. That looks easy enough to break, honestly. Oh. Uh, sure. Is it? Mm. Alright, let's just go ahead and announce our presence. Hi! Nothing? Nothing. Shit. Shit is right. Every noise is making me paranoid. <laughs> the gate's locked. I don't have a weapon. The speaker isn't working. I guess I should just search the trail. Yeah, whatever. Let's just go down this way, see if we can find a back way in. Because that's not scary at all. So if you see it jolt like this, that's me turning the right stick. It turns it in 30 degree motions, as the tutorial said. And if I tilt up, then it adjusts to point me in the way my head was facing. So, that's what all that jerking around is. Ha, <laughs> fuck me. Why would you tell me that right now? <gasps> Okay, running. Oh, old white van. That doesn't scream criminal all over it. <laughs> unmarked white van at that. I mean, br disregarding all the paint. It's unmarked. So, hole in the fence over there. I don't really want to know what's under this tarp. Coolers are empty. Cooler Ives. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Sewer Gators, episode 17, sneak into a Louisiana ghost house, schedule something, okay, oh my god, I can actually lean in, schedule equipment, okay, that's fucking weird, join us, I'd rather not if you don't mind. But that's actually fucking freaky, guys. I couldn't read that, so I physically lean in and I can get closer to it. This... Guys, this is too much. Right, th th there was something I was gonna say before I hopped into the game and I totally forgot, but I'll go ahead and say it now. I am going to accept her gift. I'm not going to accept her gift. But I am going to do... Barbed wire. My very best to beat this entire game in VR. I am going to try so hard to muscle my way through everything this game can throw at me. And, you know, I'm, I'm gonna do my best. But if I have to, if I am like mentally unable to move forward with this headset on my head, and I just have to beat the game without the headset, then I'm gonna do that. I mean, cause, like I said, I haven't felt this way in a horror game since Amnesia, which was my first horror game ever. So- Oh my god. That was Jack, right? Jack Baker? He was the one in the demo. He and Mia are the only two I've seen. It's him who jumped me from behind and said, welcome to the family in the beginning hour demo. And then Mia is the one who terrorized me in the kitchen demo. So wonderful. Oh, memories are already coming back. But yeah, again, like, I haven't felt this way in a horror game since the very first horror game I ever played. And, uh, I haven't even gotten into the house yet, and I can already tell this is gonna be worse than that. I was hoping to never feel that again. And yet here I am. So... I'm really sorry if I end up having to ditch the headset to finish this. 
but I'm gonna do my I'm gonna do my best not to. And I don't know if this game registers your PlayStation camera microphone, but uh I have it shut off, frankly. So, joke's on you. Oh god, okay. Well, at least I'm not nauseous yet. I played one demo from the oh hello. Oh god. From the demo disc? Oh, that's even better. Hoofta. Haha, <laughs> get it? Because it's hooves. Okay, I'm sorry. But, uh. Yeah. I forgot what I was saying. Right, I played. Yeah. Oh, God! Okay, yep, I, I was expecting that, honestly. So, uh. Ooh -hoo. But I'm still tingling. Alright. I played one demo from the demo disc, not, like, off camera. And it was called. Ugh. Battle Zone, I think? And the demo was literally about five, six minutes long, and by the end of it, I was so motion sick. Like, you have no idea. That's weird. There's no even transition animation or anything. Okay. Oh, blood. Okay. Alright. Oh, fuck me. My head is all over the place. Okay. There we go. So, like, yeah, the last time I played VR, I got really motion sick and really nauseous. I actually had to take a nap to, like, let my eyes rest and let my brain rest because I literally felt like I was going to puke. I've, I haven't felt that motion sick in a long time. So I was really worried when I played a full game in VR that I was going to be really nauseous, but I'm more than five minutes in at this point, I think. And, uh, oh, dead bodies. What's a shame. Okay. I don't know how you guys died. Water tower! I'd much rather climb up to that and jump off than play this game. Speaking of jumping off, do I really have to hop down? Well, I'm at the rear of the house. This is... This is odd. Okay, sorry. I can't look down that far. Otherwise the game won't register the lights on my headset. And then it's like, where are you? Gah! Okay, yeah, that was weird. Oh, fuck me. I also, I can't see a timer, so I don't know how long I've been going. I've been going for 13 minutes already. So yeah, I'm way more than five minutes into this. Not a stitch of motion sickness, so we're good. Let me guess, Mia's bag. Driver's license. I can't fucking read that, but okay. I got an achievement that doesn't show up in my headset, so I'll see it when I'm editing. It looks like somebody's trying to burn evidence. Eh. This is like that, uh... That, like, that one place in The Last of Us with all the piles of shoes and stuff. Man, that's a lot of people that didn't make it. I knew I should have turned the damn truck around. <laughs> ah, Fucking leaves. <laughs> Guys, I'm already jumping at leaves. I don't want to swing like this at my house. Ooh, I can push it. I'll just push the little ghosty girls if they want to swing. That's pretty cool. Yeah, okay. My grandma has a swing like that in her backyard, except hers is better because it overlooks a lake. Oh my god. That's already too dark. That's already too dark. Hmm. What? Hmm? If you put anything on the other side of this window, I'm gonna fucking flip my shit. Okay. This entire game, if you do anything to me, I'm going to flip my shit. I'm already flipping my shit, quite frank. <laughs> Why would you leave the back door open? Can't it all be locked? And I just leave? You know? My wife's been missing for three years. Just accept it. You know? Move on with your life. Let the, let the SWAT team or the police or whatever handle her case. Can I just not go in there? Fuck. Me. Oh, this is so fuck me. And those were not my footsteps. Oh no, they were. The feet are adjusting to the way I turned my head. Okay. Okay, so as I'm staring into the abyss of, of despair and darkness and death, I'm just gonna go ahead and point out that I'm gonna be taking this game very slowly, just like I did Amnesia. I tiptoe along every five seconds, and you guys are gonna be asking, can you please go faster, can you please go faster? My brain will not allow me to go faster, so I'm sorry. 
I'm gonna take this at my pace because you don't have to deal with this 3D fucking bullshit. Oh god, this game, the, the door's gonna shut behind me. And I'm gonna be stuck in a dark room. And it's not gonna be fun. Ah, no, Bioshock, Bioshock! Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, the lighter tracks my head. That's kinda cool. Was that a lighter? I feel like this is not the light that would come from a lighter, honestly. This is like a flashlight. Well, now. I am officially in the land of I'm fucked. <laughs> Why? Okay. Oh, you crap. You piece of crap. I recognize this now. Okay, it's easier than doing that. Okay. Creepy pictures. That one's actually nice. Can't read that trophy because it doesn't... It doesn't show up in my headset. Okay. Alright. I think I recognize this place a little too well, I think. Yay, yeah, auto saved me. Okay, good. So I can't go through that nice, tranquil walk in the woods anymore. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. I definitely. This is the very first Resident Evil biohazard I ever experienced. Oh, right. I, I, need, a, I need a pair of pliers for that. I remember. And I'm supposed to pull it out of a dead cow behind me and they get jump scared by a creepy ass doll. But that's not the case anymore, so I'm back in uncharted territory. Oh, this place looks a little different. Or maybe it does just because it actually looks like I'm in a room right now. I can't do this. Guys, nothing's even happened yet and I can't do this. I can't do this. I opened this last time. Whoa, oh Jesus. Oh God, no, get it off! Oh, I hate cockroaches. I hate them so much. Okay. Oh, fuck me. Oh, that didn't happen last time, did it? Okay. I didn't check the drawers last time, so let's just... It's a photograph. Ah, oh, fuck me. It's a photograph. There's nothing on it. Okay. I don't... Oh, I thought I saw something. Okay. Oh, fuck me. Okay, that one's locked, so I probably need a key for that. Shut up! I don't like how familiar all this looks, and yet how unfamiliar it looks at the same. Stop it. Is that me stepping on shit? It's definitely not me stepping on shit, is it? Nope, it's not. Okay. Oh wait, no, maybe it is. I'm moving stuff out of the way as I go. Okay. But that wasn't me. I'm not moving. I'm not moving. Okay. Oh, dead bird. Okay, but I can definitely tell what that is now. Okay, cool. There we go. I think your expiration date's a little up. Just saying. Close it. Close it. Close it. Close it. Can't close it. Whatever. I can't interact with the freezer, it seems. No way. I thought I could do that last time. I don't, I don't remember. So they're eating birds. Or at least microwaving them for some unknown purpose. You know, like the kid that uh, puts the cat in the microwave to see what happens and then kablooey. I didn't do that. Seriously, I didn't. What's that reading? I don't know what sounds are made. <sighs> okay, creepy ghost bitch on the stairs. Yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe, yeah, no, okay. So it looks like I just have to make my way through the demo steps, except slightly different. I don't like how I can lean, guys. I really don't like how I can lean. That's, there's immersion, and then there's like, I'm gonna shit my pants, and this is, I'm gonna shit my pants. I don't wanna go down there. Guys, I don't wanna go down there. Okay. Okay. It looks a little better now. Since I can actually fucking see. Okay. Can I go in there? Hmm, I don't like it, guys. That looks like Mia. That sucks. Nothing on the back. There's one thing I learned from Until Dawn. Oh, that does not look pleasant. There's one thing I learned from Until Dawn. Look at the, hmm, look at the back of things. What? I hope 
you guys are seeing that. Ooh, piano. Let me just tell her. Okay, maybe not. I didn't know how to play piano anyway. It's cool. What? Sorry, what? Can't believe I was just brave enough to do that. Wait, where am I? I'm okay. This is very disorienting, but I'm not motion sick yet, so I'm willing to accept it. That looks foreboding. Is that under the house? Probably. Shut up! The happy family. Looks like the owners. Yeah. Okay. So when I looked... What? Hmm? What? I wish there was a way I could turn around quicker. Okay. I don't know. That, that, was, that was glowing at me. Wait, is this still here? It's totally still there. But I, I gotta find it. I gotta find the, the clues first. I guess the game won't let me be that cool. So, there's that. I need to find the cassette tape. I need to find the fuse. Okay. Alright. Well, I didn't go upstairs. So, fuck. I'm gonna go upstairs. I suppose I should also make the warning, guys. I'm not gonna be making as much delightful commentary because I'm gonna be fucking shitting my pants. So, there's that. Alright. Let's go up. I've been up here before, too. But there were a lot of secrets in the beginning hour demo that mannequins are gone. Well, at least that's something. Um, there were a lot of secrets in the beginning hour demo that I didn't do myself. And from what I understand, um, couldn't really be solved in the first place? Like the, 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 the mannequin finger? Oh. Well, that's a little strange. Oh! That was a lot less sinister than I was expecting. Okay, so the tape recorders are save data. Noted. Yes, please. But I have the cassette tape. Derelict. Do I really have to watch all that again? Please don't jump me from behind. Please don't jump me from behind. Please don't jump me from behind. Okay. I really didn't want to move just then. All right. So if I just come up here in the first place, I could have saved myself from backtracking, so now it's gonna throw something funky at me. I thought I heard breathing, but it's my character. So we're good. Putting the tape in. And you're not gonna get me this time, bud. Lancy Javis, Derelict House, June 1st, Dolby, Louisiana. So that's what Dolby is. Okay. June 1st, 2017. Wait a minute, that didn't say 2017 last time, and I know you're coming. I know you're coming. Boo. Yep, hi. <laughs> Where did you find this guy? Can oh, now we're in 3D. Hey, okay, this is weird. I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, <sighs> sure the sound is right this time, I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. All right, Andre, I'm coming. So, this new guy? I'm not feeling it. fuck you. When they said that we have to make a the demo had nothing to do with the main game, they lied. New plan. Or maybe something different happens we when we get in there. We walk through the inside first, That's then we creepy. shoot the intro, just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking. Ah, oh, so that was our van outside. Sewer Gators. Okay, I don't remember that from when I played this however long ago. When did I play that demo? I played it when it first came out, but I don't remember when that was. Uh, it, it, it was June. Because they released it at E3, right? And I played it a couple days rolling? later. So yeah, back in June. Alright, let's go. And it is now March, <clears throat> so it's been a while. Get out of the way. Open it like a man! There you go. That was probably the worst mistake you could have ever made. After you. After you. So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sound. Ooh, is it haunted? <laughs> I really don't like this in 3D, guys. Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know? We can sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. 
We can, as in like a substitute, if the real anchors couldn't make it. <laughs> I get it. Sorry, Andre. Yeah, you suck. Abandoned farmhouse. Except you don't, because you do end up kind of saving my life. Expected. Well, I don't know about that, but sacrificing yourself for me, which may or may not have been. How long did you say really this place probably been abandoned? Three years. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. So, sure. Uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not hillbillies, the bakers. Yeah. Jack and Marguerite Baker. Marguerite is the mother. They were quiet, not backward. No, they were pretty fucking backward, I think. Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Wait, son? I don't remember there being a son. Ah, shit! Jesus Christ. I know I should have worn my good shoes. Nothing in there this oh, time. shit. Glad I had my shots. Although, Ghost sighted in Bayou. This Wonderful. This would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Yeah, he's dead already. Andre? He's gone. He's gone. Andre! He's dead. He's gone. Andre! Something different gonna happen or... No, but I know what happened. At least according to what is was in this game like six months ago. Fucking More than six months. Six, seven, eight, nine this months ago. the last time I worked with that guy. Oh, no ghost car. Okay. I mean, producers, they come and go. But a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy? Well, thanks. You stick with me. You're like me. You just say whatever <laughs> to make yourself feel better. <laughs> okay. I'm getting used to it. But I'm not going to get used to it. When, uh... Um... What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Yeah. That was, uh... That was Andre getting his jaw sh shoved through a hook, frankly. So, uh... Andre? How about we don't go in there? Where the fuck is he? You'll be fine. Nope, nothing back there. Okay, we're good. <sighs> Andre, where are you, man? Is this really all gonna be the same? Like, honestly, I seem to remember there being something I can find in, uh, in this tape version of the game, but, I mean, I'm not going for all the secrets right now. I just want to get to the credits. And one and only goal in this game. Get to the credits. That's it. Yeah. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Hey, don't face through my subtitles, right, yo. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. Sounds good to me. You ever watch, like, ghost hunter shows and stuff? I watch them every now and then. They're spooky. And although some of them are probably staged, it's still an interesting concept. You know. I'm like Michael Scott. I'm not superstitious, but I'm a little stitious. AKA, I'm a little superstitious. Oh my god, I can see him! <gasps> oh, that's creepy! A shot of me coming down the ladder. So, uh, you first. Yeah, yeah, sure. Do I just... Yeah, he's gonna phase me onto the ladder. Oh, that's weird. Okay. I have very tiny wrists. I have lady hands. Hi! <laughs> what do you see? What is it? Well, it's a dark and confined space, and I seem to be alone down here, and... Hey, Andre! Hey, buddy! What, you just hanging out there? This is not gonna look fun in 3D. This is not gonna look fun in 3D. This is not gonna look fun in 3D. Not gonna look fun. Not gonna look fun. Oh god! Ah! Ah! Oh, okay. It switches to 2D. Thank God. All right. Hey. Yeah. Okay. I've seen all of that before. So that's the. I prefer this dark movie theater look of VR than the actual 3D, because frankly, the 3D is too scary. Jesus. Yep. So, that Clancy isn't our character. We're somebody else that I don't know the name of. So... One, well... Am I gonna have to go down there and stay down there? Because obviously I'm not leaving until I find my wife. I don't know what that noise was, and I'm not gonna look. Okay. We're good. Oh uh, yeah, I totally do. I'm not going back out. The ladder's still there. Guys, the ladder isn't miraculously vanished. Like in the demo. I'm going down. And I'm staying down. 
Is his body still there? Am I gonna find him? <sighs> oh god, I feel like I should have banged my nose on there or something. Oh, Ben, the ladder just fucking broke! Ugh, fan fucking tastic. I am so fucked! Clancy and Andre are both gone. All right, hold on. Give me a second. How long have I been going? 33 minutes and still capturing. Okay, beautiful. Excuse me? Why are there moving shadows? See, the fact that I wave my hand in front and I can't see it is weird, but it also gives me like a reality check. Like, it's just a headset. It's just a game. Jedi mind trick. It's just a headset. It's just a game. <laughs> Okay, it's just the light. This is where it's gonna go to hell! And you know what? 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 I'm gonna stop this episode right here. So, yeah. I'm gonna stop that right there. That's a good intro to the game. And uh, I feel like the freaky shit is coming up real soon. So, I hope you guys are enjoying my playthrough of Resident Evil 7 Biohazard in VR. Like and favorite if you are, subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you in my next video. Farewell, friends.